Well, now to a follow up on the gas tax. That's the bill Governor Jerry Brown signed into law in April of last year. Many people in the state were upset about that tax, but not enough to repeal it during the 2018 midterm elections. KSBY's Megan Healy spoke with Caltrans about how tax dollars are being spent locally. Megan, what'd you find? Well, Karina, according to Caltrans, almost $5.5 billion will be brought in every year for California road repairs. Now, I spoke to a local Caltrans spokesperson, and they tell me that drivers can already see improvements on the local roads with nearly 50 projects already completed or in the works. Quite honestly, this is the first time I, as a taxpayer I've seen my dollars in use correctly. Caltrans recently upgraded nine miles of Highway 41 from El Camino to Los Altos Road in Atascadero. Longtime resident Angela Ramsey says it's a major upgrade. Lines were um, discolored. They were faded. They were hard to see. Um, many times cars were cutting each other off. Lanes weren't very wide. Now with the repave and the new lines, things are wider, brighter. Another woman works near this stretch of highway and says even though the construction delayed her clients, she is happy to see the change. I hate uneven roads. <laughs> They're the worst. So yeah, it's nice. Local Caltrans spokesperson Colin Jones says many projects had to be put off due to lack of funding. But these new tax dollars will be used to make the roads safer. Well, certainly none of us like to pay taxes or more taxes, but the thing about the gas taxes, that money goes directly into the transportation system. He says Caltrans strives to be transparent and accountable about the use of taxpayer money. A bigger focus is going to be 101 because the volume of traffic on 101 is much higher than some of the other routes. But if we see a highway that's really deteriorated, then we'll move that up the priority list. Jones says road maintenance is a 24-7 business, especially as traffic volumes increase. The biggest project stretches along Highway 101 from Atascadero to Paso Robles. We're getting rid of some of the old reflectors and making the new stripes wider and more visible for motors, especially during the overnight driving. Some opponents I spoke to say they would like to see more improvements to rural roads. Caltrans does most of the maintenance work during the night hours, but crews are asking people to drive carefully during those construction sites and be work zone alert. Live in San Luis Obispo, I'm Megan Healy, KSBY News. Megan, thank you. And you can track the progress on each project on the Caltrans website. The list is posted on KSBY.com links.